So one of the reasons I wanted to get Google Glass was to experiment with the Mirror API. Um, Google put up all sorts of examples on how to use Google Glass and build your own third-party apps for it. And so yesterday I took their Hello World example and kind of modified it to make my own app, which I kind of, uh, was something I kind of wanted, which was the ability to walk around it at any moment, uh, hit a, a card, and leave a note for myself. Uh, so I created this app. Now if I authorize it, uh, I authorize this web app, this is all written in Python. Um, when you authorize it, uh, I, you, I get an alert uh, and if I look at the card that pops up, and I'm sorry I can't yet show you guys what I'm seeing, I, I will be able to soon, um, I, I see a card and I can then um, save that card in my timeline. So timeline cards usually are, are temporal. They, they get pushed down by other cards and they get pushed away and they go into the past. And so if you want a card that is up and stays up, the user has to pin it to the top of their timeline. So now it's at the top of my timeline and there's another option on that card to reply to it. And if I hit reply, I can leave myself a note. I say, hey, Matt, comma, don't forget to pick up groceries on your way home from work, period. Okay, it accepted that, and it's giving me a chance to cancel now, but it's sending it off. Okay, so it got sent back to uh, my app, and if I refresh this page, there is the note that I just spoke. So uh, it transcribed it, and it sent it back to my server. The text of that got sent back to my server, and there it is. So obviously a very, very super simple app, but I did get it working. It was a bit of a challenge, and hopefully I'll be making some more interesting stuff with this in the future, but uh, I'm figuring this out slowly. That's it. Bye.